earlier and earlier every year. So you've got ours there already. We have indeed. Now, a leading clergyman says it should be done a week later. And he's been telling our reporter Sarah Elliott exactly why. The 8th of November and Manchester's big Christmas lights switch on, a sign that Christmas is approaching. But do we really need to be reminded so early? Well, apparently we too may have to curb our enthusiasm. In households up and down the land, putting up the Christmas decorations is an event in itself. But while our intentions may be well-meaning, we could be doing more harm than good. The Bishop of Bolton is urging us to think about postponing switching on our Christmas lights by at least a week. I can remember 40 years ago when I was first ordained, we used to put the Christmas tree up on Christmas Eve and dress it then. We've been getting earlier and earlier and earlier. That's okay, but now we realise that the more power we use, the more electricity we use, the more damage we're doing to the planet. It's not just our Christmas lights we're being encouraged to think about. Many of us apparently travel more visiting relatives. And government research shows we use enough wrapping paper to wrap up Guernsey. In Withenshaw, residents are putting the final touches to their decorations. They think the planet has more to worry about. We have loads of kids coming round and they enjoy it, so I turn them on as early as possible. I think the handful of people that actually put lights up, I don't think it would make a great deal of difference anyway. Do you think, though, it could be contributing to damaging the environment at all? Uh, well, not really, because, I mean, it, it's only electric at the end of the day, isn't it? I love these houses being lit up, uh, but they are lit up earlier and earlier and earlier, and I think I encourage people to light them up a bit later, switch them off a bit and perhaps not have them on quite as often, but then come next year to decide to put them up a bit later because we've got to find ways of using less energy than we do at the moment. The Bishop of Bolton isn't against Christmas lights altogether. After all, he'll be switching on his own, not before Christmas Eve. Sarah Elliott, Grenada reports. Mm. Yes, yes, there will be people who have noticed that we have already got our lights on in here, but do we switch on our lights too?